On January 11, 2018, Ravi Ragbir disappeared. He is one of the most influential voices for immigrants' rights in New York City. And the situation is making headlines. Ravi is an immigrant from Trinidad and has spent over 20 years fighting for the rights of immigrants when nobody else would. But now, he's the one that needs to be defended. Ravi was headed for a routine immigration check-in when he was inexplicably detained by ICE. His detention led to a massive, spontaneous protest that resulted in the arrest of 18 supporters. Included among the arrested were peaceful religious leaders and city politicians. The incident flooded New York City media outlets. The executive director of New York City's New Sanctuary Coalition has been detained by Immigration and Customs Enforcement. Why does everyone care so much about Ravi? Despite his controversial immigration case, Ravi's helped thousands. Ravi leads seminars to teach volunteers how to accompany immigrants to their immigration checks. The community that can help needs to know how to, to communicate with the community that needs the help in certain concrete ways. One year ago, we met Ravi and learned his story. Ravi emigrated from Trinidad decades ago and acquired his green card in 1994. He has an American wife and American children. But because of a fraud conviction that he's still trying to overturn, he lives in constant fear that he could get deported at any time. So when we heard about his detention, we had to show our support. So Brian and I are in Midtown Manhattan and we just found out that Ravi got detained by ICE today. They are holding a vigil downtown to show some support and we're gonna go in solidarity. What we found was a massive crowd of people in front of the ICE detention center, making their voices heard and demanding answers. The marching has continued today, on MLK Day, where hundreds have gathered here in Washington Square Park. The question is, where is Ravi? On Saturday, Ravi was able to release this video detailing his situation and the mystery and uncertainty surrounding it. And if you're hearing this, it is because I was taken in by ICE. What we are asking you to do is if you want to stop this, you have to act now. Ravi is being held at the Crone Detention Center in Florida, where he's one step closer to getting deported. We don't have to feel completely helpless. Join the voices demanding Ravi be freed. Please support Ravi by calling the numbers on your screen.